Hey guys, so today I'm back with a packing for short trips video. I am going to Miami this Thursday. I'm really excited. It's winter music conference, house music, and all that good stuff. I'm gonna um show you guys what I did and how I packed my stuff just so everything is organized. Because you know a lot of times when you travel, you just tend to throw outfits after outfits and you don't really put them together, or at least if you're not organized like me, because I'm not really an organized person, I never put them together or think ahead of like what's gonna go with what I just sort of pile everything in my bag and then I choose the outfits when I get there but this is a more productive way and a more organized way to um, travel as well as packing less so this includes clothes jewelry I'll probably do a separate video on what hair products and makeup I am bringing for warm weather in today's video I have my friend Melissa you guys know her from previous videos yay is. I'm not a very organized person, but my mother actually gave me these ideas and I put them to use. This is a pretty good idea. Right? Yeah. Oh yeah, and I'm also putting things in Ziploc bags. I know, it's kind of weird, but you guys will see. Um, But it's a genius idea because you did it by day. Exactly. And so you have like everything, and you guys are going to see it. Yeah. Everything is like jewelry is in with the outfit, which is perfect. I can't do that, so I give you props. I would never be able <laughs> to do that. Because you know what? It's convenient. Like, when you get over there, you already know exactly what you're going to wear or what jewelry goes with what, so you don't have to be like, oh my god, what am I going to wear, yada, yada, yada. And especially for you, you travel so much. Yeah. Basically, for everyone that's traveling, this is a really, really kind of like a how-to or tips on how to pack because usually we're, you know, we usually procrastinate. Yeah, we do. Right? And we also <laughs> throw in more than what we need. So... Yeah. So we don't want to do that. Procrastinators <laughs> out there, everyone that's traveling all the time. And people that are overpackers. Yeah, These overpackers. These are for the overpackers. This is the video just for you. you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so this is basically an overview of the outfits. Those are my morning or, you know, in the daytime outfits. And these are my nighttime party dresses. Basically what I did was get a large Ziploc bag, one like this, and then I put the dress in here that I'm going to wear and the jewelry in a separate, uh, in a smaller Ziploc bag with the bracelets, the earrings, the necklace, and the ring if I'm going to wear a ring that day that I'll be using with this outfit. Of course, you don't necessarily have to pair up this with this, but you kind of already have a feel of what goes with what, like based on the jewelry. What I'm trying to do is use a lot of bright colors with material um, that's really light that, you know, you're not going to get too hot and sweaty in because we don't want to be sweaty. So what I've paired up, opened up my Ziploc bag, and it also keeps the clothes from getting dirty. A lot of the times, you know, let's say shampoo spills or something like that may spill. Um, your stuff is nice, nicely packed in a Ziploc bag so it won't get dirty. I've paired up these American Eagle shorts. And I'm pairing up the royal blue shorts with this crop t-shirt. It's cotton, very light. And it has this nice little crisscross detail in the back. For jewelry, which I have in another Ziploc bag. So this is for like the morning. If I'm going to like a pool party or something like that, I'll probably pair this up with like wedges just to sort of dress up this outfit a little bit more but still be very comfortable bracelet right here then I have these earrings that have a little bit of orange to sort of play up the orangey-ish red tones in the blouse so I think these are from Forever 21 and this I got at a little boutique and why I like to put these in a Ziploc bag also like a separate one is just in case I don't want this, you know, the par the pointy part of the earring breaking a hole in the shirt or anything like that. And also, jewelry tends to have like a scent, and I don't want that scent to rub off on the clothing. That is outfit number one. These are day outfits. Yeah, these are day outfits. So the second outfit is are these shorts, white shorts from um, Abercrombie and Fitch. Then I'm gonna wear this flowy blouse. It's kind of see-through, but that's perfectly fine. Probably gonna have a bathing suit under this because um, I'm gonna wear this for one of the pool parties, I think. Probably when I go see Calvin Harris at the Sir Comfort Hotel, I think it is. It has sort of these kimono-like sleeves. And what I like about it is that it has this seam right here, so it divides your, you know, where your hand goes and where you're actually your torso goes. So it gives you a lot more shape. 
the jewelry that I'm gonna wear. I'm gonna pair them up with these two silver bangles. This ring from Forever 21 and these silver earrings that look like, if I can actually untangle them, these sort of gypsy-like earrings. And that's outfit number two. Next outfit are these hot pink shorts that I got at some little boutique, I think in the city or something. Pairing them up with this sort of, um, kind of reminds me of like a linen material. And I got this shirt at H&M. It says, I love London, New York, Paris, and Tokyo. Kind of long. But I'm probably going to wear it with like a bright hot pink bra or a bathing suit underneath. And jewelry is pretty simple. I'm going to play off the rockerish, rocker chic look by adding this cute little guitar necklace. I think I got this at Forever. This bracelet. I don't remember where I got this. And I have these cute, simple earrings. They're just like little button earrings. For the next outfit, I have these highlighter yellow shorts. They're, they have these like, uh, the ruffles, not the ruffles, what is it called? Fringe? No. Yeah, like the little fringe. fringe. They're kind of really short. But I have this blue top and this is from H&M. I like the racerbacks, those are my favorite. Like this. The jewelry that I have for this is sort of like this tribal meets like super neon party person. <laughs> This is my favorite outfit. Yeah? For the day. This is from Forever 21. I love Forever 21 jewelry. And these earrings. Aren't these cute? Are they like cheetah print? Uh, yeah, they're like cheetah print. Cute. And these are also from Forever 21. I'm not going to show you guys my nighttime outfits because I plan on doing outfits of the night over there. So basically, you get a little sneak preview. You may see the color, but you don't really know the cut of the dresses. So I have this little bag. I think this came with a perfume set or something. And I just told my mom, hey, I'm going to take this because this is great. For packing your undies, your bathing suits, and your bras. So that's exactly what I have here. All my underwears, my bras. I basically did not overpack bras and undies either. Of course, you're going to always want to bring a few extra. This is the bright pink. This is super bright. You were talking. I love how you opened that. This is this so is dramatic. <laughs> I'm going to pair this up with the hot pink shorts and that top from, um, I think it was H&M. H &M, yeah. yeah, the I Love London, New, New York. York. <laughs> So, I yeah. want to see bathing suits. Can you show me one? Yeah. I'm pretty sure your viewers want to see this too. I mean, I don't have anything special. These are the bottoms of one of my bathing suits. I think this is from, it's from Target, but it's that uh, Converse brand. So, it's the bottom. Cute, you know, simple. Blue and black. Then I have this to pair it up with. I like more like the bandeau sort of tops. I feel like they look better on me. Then I have this other top and I have another pair of black bottoms, plain black bottoms somewhere in here. My viewers are just going to have to wait till they see my footage of me in Miami to see my bathing suits. And I got this really cute pink tan bag. This is from Nine West, really cheap. It's a cute tote bag. This is where I'm going to put my Makeup, very light makeup because it's, you know, if I'm going to be outside sweating. I probably won't even wear eyeshadows. I'm not really a big fan of eyeshadows when it's like super scorching hot outside. Right, so I hope this video was helpful. Let me know if you guys are planning on traveling and if you're using any of my ideas. Also, if you have any ideas of your own, let me know in the comment box below how to be more organized and not overpack when you're traveling. I also want to thank my friend Melissa for being the filmographer for today's video because if it wasn't for her, this video probably, probably would have been like really shaky. Thanks Melissa! You're welcome! <laughs> Subscribe to her, I'll include her link down below.